Welcome back to my playthrough of the Trespasser DLC for Dragon Age Inquisition. Thank you for joining me again. Well, we're supposed to investigate the Kunori plot. We don't know what the heck is going on. We find an Alluvian here. We went through the Alluvian. We found a bunch of Kunari. Some of them were dead. But as soon as they saw the Inquisition, they attacked us. So, why? What are they doing here? What's going on? Um, I believe we uh, talked to Josephine at the end of the last episode. Hello, my love. And so she has nothing new to say to us. Hello, my love. Except for hello, my love, over and over again. So what we're going to do is we are going to uh, run over here and uh, start this next objective while admiring the beautiful tile work on the floor here. Uh, actually, I'm not sure where I'm going. Is it um, up here, maybe? Or is it down below? Oh, I can't go anywhere. I can't go that way. So we'll run down here. And run over here. Is it? Maybe it's down and around here. I'm not sure where I'm supposed to go, to tell you the truth. Is it through this door? Ah, oh, this looks new. Something right over here to read. I don't think I've read this. Ooh, Hard in High Town, Chapter 16, by Varric Tethris. Donnan left the tavern and headed out through a moonless night. Fog clung to the streets and buildings like cobwebs, and the heavy air threatened rain. Any other night, he would have gone straight up to the barracks, but he had appointments to keep. The keys at midnight exchanged the cacophony of swearing sailors for the mournful sound of distant bells in the harbor. Donnan found Wagner and his two thugs waiting just out of sight of the harbormaster's office. In the fog, Wagner's white Samite coat made him gleam like a smug moon. Monsieur Breno Branokovic, I trust you've brought my merchandise? Wagner smiled. Beside him, the tattooed chastened cleaned what might have been blood from his nails with his dagger. Donnan reached into his coat and pulled out a small cloth-wrapped bundle. We should discuss a few things first. Wagner's eyes gleamed in the reflected light of his paunch. The price, of course. He gestured to the scarred Ander, who held up a bag of coins. One hundred crowns should suffice, yes? That depends. Donnan toyed with the twine, securing the bundle's wrapping. You killed Magistrate Dunwall, didn't you? After my run-in with your friends here, I realized the only blade that could have made that kind of stab wound was your chastened stone knife. Wagner shrugged. Men die all the time, Sarah. We should not let that unpleasantness get in the way of business. Another gesture, and the Ander strode forward to stand just inches away from Donnan, brandishing the bag of gold like a flail. And Jevlon? Donnan asked. I know nothing of your partner's fate. Donnan handed over the bundle and the Ander dropped the bag at his feet to deliver the prize to his boss. Uh, yeah. Wagner eagerly unwrapped the bundle, revealing an ancient, rusty, and pitted short sword. He frowned. This is not the blade. Both Chastened and Ander drew their daggers. Donnan held his ground. Pity you killed Dunwall for it, then. You think I'd kill a magistrate and not a guardsman? Wagner laughed. Unwise, sirrah. That's all we needed to hear. Captain Hendallen stepped around the corner behind Donnan, a dozen guards with her. For the first time in months, he saw what might have been a smile on her face. Good work, guardsmen. We'll take it from here. Good stuff. Alright, y'all. What's going on in here? What's through here? An Alluvian! Who would have guessed? Who would have guessed that there would be an Alluvian in here? Alright, let's go through it. Do we need to choose our party again, or are we just going to stick with the same party we had before? Okay. Uh, well, I mean, I was okay with the party that I had before, but I also kind of like to mix things up a little bit. Um, let's take Varric this time. And um, let's see, for uh, Magic, we'll take Vivienne. And um, let's see, I took Cassandra last time, so we'll take Iron Bull this time. I don't know how I feel about this party, but we'll go with it. Well, acquired the divine. Hey, Ben Abasto hustled. Mm. Guess they didn't feel like talking. It's actually probably Agarhoff a. Wasn't there before. Oh, 
Maybe the Kunari figured out a way to make new paths. Oh, okay. Um, 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 um. Uh, anyway, I was gonna say, uh, it's good that I've got Bull here, because at least he's a Kunari, you know. Maybe you could try to talk to him. So they said that path wasn't here before. Which path are they talking about? I'm not sure. Because I remember running down here. And there was nothing for us down here. What's so wrong? Huh. Everyone doesn't like you? This mirror doesn't look broken, but it's inactive. Maybe there's a way to unlock it. Maybe there's a way to unlock it. So did he say that the last time we were at that mirror? Or did he say it at a different mirror? I don't remember. Um, still don't know. Place what? Place. <laughs> okay. My cunning went up by six. I just placed a top hat on this skeleton here. Uh, and I remember picking up that top hat when we were running around uh, searching for items out in the um, palace area. I still don't know what they mean by that path wasn't here before, because this path was here. Or do they mean this path over here? Maybe that's what they mean. Actually, you know what? That is what they mean. That path was not there. So we've already looked around here. I don't think there's any reason to do it again. So instead, we are going to go ahead and take this path, which will uh, lead us over to this alluvian. Not sure what this is right here. What is this? Let's examine it. Don't know what to tell you. Don't know what to tell you. Oh well, okay. Well, I don't know what to tell me either. Well, um, all right. Let's see where they were going. Well, I'm gonna go up here first, okay? Oh, another alluvian. Crap. Well, I don't really know which one I should take, but I'm going to take this one because it seems a little out of the way. You know, whereas the other one was obvious. You couldn't miss that one. This one, yeah, you could miss this one. Uh, but before we go in, maybe we should uh, spend a little bit of time uh, up upping our uh, character traits and such. Um, Varric is archery dude, and I'm going to say that... What the hell? Oh. I'm going to say that he's probably uh, maxed out on everything. No, he's not. Wow, I'm surprised. So let's give him pincushion, strafing shots. Oh, I can't unlock that one. Uh, leaping shots. Okay. You know what? He's actually, I actually, I guess I actually don't have him as my archer guy, do I? Since I'm an archer, I probably had him focusing more on uh, subterfuge. Right? This kind of stuff. Yeah, this is what I have him doing. Um, but... I'm going to go ahead and put points into that. Okay. And... Okay. Whatever. There. I'll do that. Apply that. All right, computer, do something good with that. And then uh, we'll see what Vivienne has. What can we do with her? Um, she is, let's see, she does some spirit stuff, it looks like. And I think she's frost. Yeah, so she does frost stuff. Um, but she also does some spirit stuff, it looks like. Yeah. I mean, I could choose these, but she doesn't really have any slots for them. Resurgence, Fade Cloak, Spirit Blade. Well, that is a knight. Or is, is that knight enchanter stuff? It is, isn't it? Well, yep, looks like I've already got this tree maxed out. I do. So she's a knight enchanter. Huh, I didn't know that's how I had her set up. And then here... There, we'll just put some points in here, whatever. And then finally, um, Iron Bull here. He is my um, two-handed guy, two-handed weapon guy. And he's maxed out on this.
but he also does some stuff in the red tree. Unfortunately, there's a whole bunch of red trees, so I don't really know. Okay, this one, Reaver. I guess, is he a Reaver? Um, yeah, he is, he's a Reaver. Okay, well, is there anything I could give him here? Wow, he's, he's maxed out on Reaver. Holy cow. Well, I don't really know what to do with his other point then, you know, because everything else. Uh, grappling chain, hamstring, when you attack a target from behind, you leave them slowed or crippling blows. You know how to take a fight out of your foes. Your critical hits leave enemies weakened. Sure, we'll do that. Here. Put a lot of thought into that, now didn't I? And I know I could still level up, but I don't really know what to do with myself. So, let's go through this Alluvian and uh, see where it takes us. Not quite where we wanted to go, but still not bad. Not quite where... How do you know where we want to go? Here's something to loot. This is probably going to unleash hell when I go to unloot this, isn't it? When I go to loot this, not un unloot. This bag has uh, Fade Touched Hardened Gernhide. Just what I always wanted. And uh, just something to loot here. Yep, sure enough. We knew. So, here we are fighting. We got a Despair Demon over here. We got quite a few things over here that I don't even remember how to fight. Um, boy, I do not remember at all how to fight these things. And I feel like I'm not doing any damage to them at all. I put him to sleep. <laughs> oh, holy cow. Whoa, whoa, something hurts bad. What the? Okay, are you going to take health or not, dude? I told you to take health. Holy hell, that hurt. Oh boy, that was a big mistake coming here. Okay, can I kill somebody, please? Holy cow, this rage demon! Oh my gosh! And I'm dead. Okay, well, how am I supposed to live through that? Oh, I'm. This is it. This is the first time my party dies. Yeah, there is nothing I can do. Holy mother! Nothing. Nothing. Where the hell is my cursor? Okay, Varric's up. I can't even find the rest of my party. Holy mother! Are you gonna take health or not? God, that's annoying. Alright, I cannot find the rest of my party. Here's Iron Bull. Where's my cursor? Good lord. Why is Iron Bull not coming up? What are you doing, man? Oh, because she's dead. Yeah, this is, um... This is unwinnable. I, I, am, I am not prepared for this. Jeepers creepers. Okay, I died. Um, holy hell. What in the world am I supposed to do with that? Where we wanted to go, but still not bad. I mean, I don't know what's in this box, but it better be pretty freaking awesome. Good grief. I mean, those things were like level 28. I am level 25, so she's level 24. So yeah, th th those things were quite a bit higher level than my team is. And I don't feel like I was even coming close to beating them. I mean, not even close. But look at me doing it again. See if I can pull one of them to sleep. Okay. There's demon asleep. And this guy's got freaking a shield or something. I need to get out of this corner. I need to get out of this corner. Come on, take take it. 
Nope, that's not what I wanted. Oh gosh, somebody's already dead? Oh, why am I shooting that way? Oh man. Okay, I've got a uh, regen potion. Holy mother! Oh my gosh. Oh gosh. The Drage Demon has no damage to it. Oh man. Come on. Oh. This sucks. Yeah. Yeah, it sucks for obvious reasons, but. What? Are they not doing any damage to this thing at all? Oh, this, this is terrible. Okay, well, I'm going to die again, obviously. There's nothing I could do about it. I mean, I'm just... Yeah. Alright. Well, so... I have no business being here at all. None whatsoever. I mean, none. I can't even find my party. I don't know where the rest of my party is. There's a body. Now where's my cursor? Good lord. Alright, I'm up. Oh gosh. Ah, just kill me already. There's nothing I could do. Yeah, alright. Okay, that's just a shame. Okay, well, I am not ready for that at all. Oh man, the problem is that I probably can't... Precisely where we intended to go, darling. But still, an amusing diversion. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go over and loot this sack. Um, but... I mean, I guess maybe at some point I'll come back... For this, maybe? But holy hell... Uh, I am not ready for that. That... Man, that sucks, because I mean... You know, I felt like I was kind of holding my own in the other battles up till now. But that was just insane. I mean, I couldn't do anything. So I'm worried about what's what I'm going to see here. I don't know how I'm supposed to level up. Doggone it. That's just really disappointing and frustrating. I can't I even come close to fighting them. Not even close. Well, there's some enemies up ahead. Those canari can't have gotten far. Be ready. There they are. So he's asleep. Do something. Ben Hasrath agents. Buddy here. So these guys are level 25, so... Whoa, hey. That's not cool, man. Get away from me. Oh, he's got that stupid armor crap on him. Gosh, I hate that. Oh, darn it. What the heck? I think I accidentally pressed a button that I shouldn't have pressed. Alright, got my health back. Get away from me! Leave me alone! Fight my other party members! Maybe this party I chose just sucks, you know? Maybe that's it. Okay, I should be jumping now, why am I not? Oh, get away from me. This guy needs to die. Get away from me. <laughs> Fight the other guys. I'm trying to get in here and help Iron Bull with my regen potion. Come on, Iron Bull. There. Healing him up. Low health again. Alright, we got him at least. 
Whew, good grief. Whoa, what was that all about? One down. We good? Why would a mystical elven mirror lead here? We need to find out what these Kunari were up to. So let's go see, shall we? Come on, stand close to me so I can heal you. Don't walk away from me. Look at him walking away from me. Stay close to me so I can heal you, jerk. <laughs> All right. Oh man, nothing on the ground. Nothing for me to loot. Nothing at all, huh? Well, okay, fine. Be that way. The grand stairway. Something to read. It looks like there was a bad cave in. Kunari writing. This paper is covered in what appear to be mathematical calculations. An extremely precise and detailed sketch of the wall has been heavily annotated with measured angles, dimensions, and several lines of text in Kunlat. Whatever conclusions were drawn about the measurements are lost, the page has been ripped, seemingly by sharp teeth, and much of the remaining paper is hidden by a hardened layer of dried blood and dust from the cave-in. Okay, and then we got this guy over here to loot. Oh, goody. Veil quartz. Okay, I don't care about that. Alright, party, let's keep moving. Whoa, look at this place. Look at all that. The Kunari have a huge operation here. Yeah, but for what? But for what indeed? Well, there sure are a lot of them down here. They could bring the whole cavern down. This place isn't stable. This place isn't stable. Oh, okay. Didn't see this. What the? Your hands doing that thing again. Well, maybe the anchor could make itself useful down here. Maybe. Let's see. Kind of dark down here. What are these things? We're definitely up to something. Excavating that cave in, maybe. Let's go see what's going on over here. Listen to Varric. I'm sure he's going to have something very useful to say. Great. We're in the deep roads. I feel myself getting dwarfier by the minute. Did I just sprout a beard? Nah, I hate caves. On slopes, uneven ground, the dark, pretty much all kinds of weather. And Orlesians, Ferelvans, Navarans, Mages, Templars, the entire Merchant Guild, nuns. Look, I have to complain, or you'll forget I'm here and trip over me. I'm providing a service. <laughs> Oh, something down here. Snappy little assholes. Whoa, hey. What are these things? Like, uh, velociraptors. You're already low health because of these things? What, what, what? Where'd they go? Did we kill them? What the, what the hell? Oh, these are deep stalkers. Alright, what was the deal with them disappearing? I don't like how much damage these damn things are doing. Well, they are level 25, but still. I mean, look, they're about to kill Iron Bull. He's going through his potions like Kool-Aid. Look at this. When I walk away, they disappear. It's gotta be a glitch, right? Good grief, Bull is going through the potions way too quick, man. Son of a bitch. When I walk away, they disappear. And that's bad because my I'm an archer. I'm supposed to be away from them. Are they dead now? That was that was dumb. Well, this place is all kinds of fun. Right? Oh, another one. More. Ouch. Man, these things are giving me way more trouble than they should. Oh my 
gosh. This is ridiculous. That doesn't sound good. Look at our health. I have no regen potions. Oh man. Um well, actually I thought I I leveled everybody up before I went to the Alluvian, right? So I mean have they already leveled up again? Yeah, I guess they have. Okay, well, I'm not gonna go through that right now. Uh okay, here's something behind me, something over here that I missed. Something to read. Torn Notebook in the Deep Roads Section 1. Many of these pages are filled with sketches of elven statues matching the ones found in the area, along with notes that and what look like attempts to practice Kunlat. Ebost, you all are. Ebadim, they all are. Ebsam, we all are. If Fenharal truly has agents working against us, then the Dreadwolf must be laughing at me. The Blight takes my clan, so I go to Kirkwall. Kirkwall goes to ruin, so I flee to the Kun. Now the Kunari bring me down into the lightless depths, and for what? Because the nursery rhymes I remember from childhood make me an expert on ancient elves. These statues are old, better shaped than anything I've seen on the surface. Many of them are for Mithal, though, and Fenharal. Not in a spot of honor, but guarding, attending. Uh, protector and all mother, why are you honored here, so far from the light of the sun? And why was the Dreadwolf at your side? I, I don't have an answer for you. Okay, we're gonna have him take a regen potion and just kind of like, you know, everybody come in here and heal up. Don't walk away. Come here. Ugh. Because I'm trying to heal everybody, but they're walking away. Come here, moron. I'm trying to heal you. There. You can't go anywhere now, can you, smart guy? Alright. As soon as this guy heals up, we'll move on. I just want to make sure he gets all of his health back. Because apparently I need it. Holy cow. I mean, those stupid deep stalkers were giving me all kinds of trouble. That's ridiculous. Alright. Almost fully healed. Alright, onward we go. Let's see what's in here. Man, I do not like how hard this game got all of a sudden. I, I'm really wondering if this party I've got is just not a good party. What are the Kunari even doing in a place this awful? I don't know, man. I don't have an answer for you. Whoa. Doesn't really go anywhere. Look, someone up ahead. I think he's human. Oh, somebody down there. Well, um, yeah, there was somebody there, but I feel like there was more to explore. where I came from? Yeah, I guess it is. I got a little turned around there. Huh. Yeah, I'm not finding any goodies. Nothing to loot. Nothing to read. I guess we'll go down here to this human. I can remember how to get to him. I feel like I'm going the wrong way. Discovered Stay hideout. Back. Oh. Wait. Your hand. Are you the Inquisitor? Odd to find a human down in the deep roads at all, let alone surrounded by Kunari. We don't have much time. Please, what the Vidasala is doing, you have to stop her. The Vidasala? That's a high-ranking Bin Hasrath. Specializes in magic. Finding, studying, stopping. Not anymore. 
I don't care whether you serve Fenharel or not. Someone has to stop her. Why do you think I serve Fenharel? Why do the Canari think that the Inquisition serves Fenharel? I don't know. The Vidasala said it, and the Canari here accepted as fact. We've had agents of Fenharel causing trouble all over the crossroads. Sabotage, making spirits attack us. I assume the Inquisition was their army. That you came here because Fenharel told you to. Um... Who are you? Who are you, exactly? My name is Jeren. Sir Jeren, once. I was a Templar in Kirkwall. Until I joined the Kune. Your Kunari? Kirkwall was... Madness. Chaos. The Kunari were like the eye of a storm. I stand for order and discipline. Protecting the innocent from magic. But this plan... It's as mad as Meredith ever was. Um, let's see. He's talked about stopping something. What is it you want me to stop? This place is a Lyrium mining and processing center. The Canari need it for... Have you ever heard of Sarabas? Dangerous thing. It's what the Kune calls mages. Even as a Templar, I'd never seen anything like the power Sarabas can unleash. And now Vidasala is giving them Lyrium. A lot of Lyrium. It's part of something she calls Dragon's Breath. That's a load of crap. There's no way the Vidasala would let any Sarabas within a thousand feet of Lyrium. There's more to it than that, but I couldn't find out what. The Canari don't like it when you ask too many questions. Let's investigate. What is this place? Where are we? Why are there elven mirrors in the deep roads? This place is close to something like a Lyrium spring. The more we mine, the more there seems to be. As for the mirrors, I don't know. Maybe the elves were mining here too. What are you doing down here? The Canari wanted me to teach them everything I knew about Lyrium. Where it comes from, everything it can do, how we put it to use. I knew enough from my time in the Order. They figured out more. I'm not sure how. Maybe they got to the Carter. The Kunari can't be mining their own Lyrium. It kills anyone who tries other than dwarves. It killed the Kunari at first. The Kunari workers have a discipline only Tranquil can match. And they're quick learners. They figured it out. Hmm. Um... You had said something about Dragon's Breath? That's not seriously the name of the plan, is it? Dragon's Breath. You know that most Dragon's Breath destroys everything in its path, right? She said it would save the South. That can mean only one thing. An invasion. This mine is the only source of Lyrium the Canari have. They're using Gatlock, the explosive powder in the round casks, to mine, so they don't have to touch raw Lyrium. If you get the primers from Central Supply, you can prime the Gatlock and detonate it. The mines will go up in flames. Will that, will that be enough? Even if I succeed, will that really stop the Vidasala? It would be a start. Deep Stalkers and Cavins will cut off reinforcements. But they'll still come when they hear trouble. You've got to find the Vidasala to end this war before it begins. Let him try to escape the mine or I can't let you live. I'm not gonna execute him, he just told us everything. Jeez, get out of here, dude. There's no telling how bad things will get when I destroy the mine. You'd better get moving. I will. Good luck, Inquisitor. Let's go. We have a Lyrium mine to ruin. So, Iron Bull slightly disapproved of what we just did. Boy, there sure are a lot of enemies on my, uh, mini-map there. Oh, good, a supply crate. Thank gosh. Yeah, I was hurting, man. Can't talk to him anymore. And, um... Nothing else down here for us, so we need to find Gatlock Primers. I oh, mean, I don't want to open this door. There's a bunch of bad guys behind it. Hmm, how come this didn't get replenished? He's okay. She's okay. Alright. I don't want to open this door. Yep. Oh, stupid. Let him go. Let him go. Let him go. Maybe they'll uh, fight the Kunari for us. Let them go.
Oh, damn it. Not so much for that idea. Don't like fighting these. Surprised at how much damage they did. Okay, we got them. And they, they don't give us anything either. I mean, I guess they help me boost this bar here. And of course we get some experience points for killing them, but... We don't get any cool loot from killing them. And I like loot. Oh, more trouble up ahead. Looks like more Darkstalkers. Holy hell, there's a lot of them. Ouch. Stop it. Goodbye. Uh, did we get him? Alright. Okay, good job, team. Good job. Still don't like it. Don't like it at all, man. Oh, what's this? What's that over there? Is that another dark, dark stalker? What is this? Detonate. We saw the Kunari make these things explode. Maybe we can use them to get out of here. Gadlock. Yeah, that'll definitely explode. Be careful. Be careful. Okay, well that's what we came here for, this Gatlock. Well, let us um, detonate the Gatlock and uh, run away from it, I would imagine, right? Okay, dude, you're the one who told me to be careful, yet you stood right next to it, Iron Bull. What the hell, man? What the hell? I guess I could have told him to... Move. Why is it so dark? Don't dwarven runes usually glow with lyrium or lava or whatever's running through the walls? I don't know, man. Read. Charred note. This note is written in both common and kunlat. The letters are shaky. These walls of blue flame here... Here. These walls of blue flame were cast by the agent of Fenharal as he ran through this place, bringing chaos and destruction. Do not light fires from them. Do not go near them. Fenharel's mage servant made them to hamper us, and they bring only death. Yeah, that they do. But there's a ladder over there, and I want to go up it. So... Doo -doo -doo -doo, I'm invincible! Hopefully the rest of my party won't be dumb enough to try to follow me over here. Loot. Uh, gold and the s sigil of the Highland Ravager. I think that's how you pronounce that. I'm not even sure. <laughs> you have found a sigil. Sigils can be attached to armors and give them special bonuses along with unique hinder hindrances. Something else here. Oh, it's just a dumb ladder. I kind of hate that the ladders show up on my on my pulses because they're not exciting. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, man, I still took some damage. What the hell? I'm supposed to be invincible. Alright, well. Listen to Iron Bull. Hey, Iron Bull, speak. I'm not Kunari anymore. Whatever they're doing, I'm ready to stop. So, nothing for you to worry about, ma'am. I mean, your holiness. I thought he was being disrespectful. But he corrected himself. 
Uh, there's a dude over there. And there's a bit of fire over here that I'm going to try not to step in. But I do want to loot this. Sigil of the Deepstalker. Plus 200% flanking damage, minus 50% attack. Not sure how I feel about that. Whoops. Uh. Yeah. Fire or electricity damage instantly detonates primed Gatlock. Okay. Well, now you tell me. I'm not gonna detonate it now. That did too much. That did fair amount. Oh, whoa, there's a guy right here. I didn't see him this close. Alright, so somebody's already dead. Iron Bull. Did a fair amount of damage. Someone help. Um, there's somebody with a skull there. Oh, oh that's Iron Bull. Oh, okay. It's been a while since I played it, I don't remember anything. That dude's running back. Right, I'm gonna go heal Iron Bull. You guys keep them busy. Now, damn it, what did I just say to you? I said keep them busy. Discovered mining and processing. Did you tell me where HR is? Oh. Now, uh, somebody else is dead. Eric. Alright, we need to kill this guy. Die already. Alright, he's dead. Get up, Varric. Quit, quit acting like you're dead. You're not dead. Get up. Get up. We're done fighting. Get up. What is she doing? Stop it. Fine, I'll heal you. Alright. Everybody's back up. My health is in bad shape, and I've only got six potions left. I am not liking my odds here. There's an enemy running right to the other side of this. I don't see him, though. Oh, there he is. Hey, dude, what's up? Oh, man, that was cool. Oh, oh nope, I didn't kill him. Oh, I thought I killed him. Yes, I did. Here comes another guy. Is the same? No, same guy. Okay, whatever. What do I know? You know, okay. I went through one Kunari invasion. I was really hoping I'd never see another. Yeah. Well. Guess I'll take a health potion. Whoa! Where the hell? Where did this guy come from? Whew. Up here was another guy. I see you. And I jumped to my death. <laughs> Alright. Oh, come on now. Iron Bull's dead again. I jerk. Still not dead. Two members of my party are dead because of this jerk. Alright, just finish him off already. He's still not dead? Good lord, finish him off! This guy made out of Sheesh. Man, I am not liking this at all. I am in need of a supply cache. Can I jump up there? Um, maybe not. Oh boy. There's one of the mining platforms. Now we just need primers. 
Find Gatlock primers. Anybody know where Gatlock primers are? Something over here. Oh, I'll go to your ladder. Now, wait a minute now. Huh. Hmm. I mean, I... I already tried to get up here. And I guess I don't have that kind of jumping ability in this game. So, that's not a ladder to go down. That's a ladder to come up, maybe. Not finding any primers. So... around the corner here. Not too happy about it. Uh, damn. There's even more around this corner as well. The dark Inquisitor? Who said that? Who said that? Did you say that? They found us! We are doing hardly any damage to these guys at all. Oh, hell. Ah. Oh, man, I did the freezy thing on me, but it doesn't seem to be doing any good. Come on, let's, let's take these guys out at least. Okay, at least we got these two. Let's see, let's use this as a flashlight. See if there's anything good in here. There's that ladder we saw a moment ago. Or I could go this way. That's gonna take me down there. So that'll take us back up to where we just were. That looks like a perfect target. Don't you agree, my dear? Wow, I really don't know what you're talking about, lady. Okay, we got this one guy here. I'd like to take it. Oh, here comes another one. Here comes some more. This is bad. Yep, Iron Bull's dead. They didn't take a regen potion. Maybe he'll heal these guys up. Well, unfortunately, he can't revive Iron Bull. Come on, heal! Alright. Oh, I'm almost dead. Damn these guys. Oh, two dead. Oh. Two of them, two of us. Come on, finish him off. See if we can get him back alive. Oh, damn it. Alright, take him. Bring him back. Oh, good, there's supply cache here. Come on, let's get this guy. Whoa, look what he left behind. <laughs> Bull was talking when he was dead. I don't know if you noticed that or not. Um... So this is something we could detonate. I want to practice here, because it says we could detonate it with electricity or something else. I don't remember which. She doesn't have electricity, but... Hmm. Okay, that... That doesn't seem to be doing anything, so that's not going to help. So, it doesn't look like I can uh, do anything about it from a distance. All right. Everybody get in a corner so I can heal you all. And then I'll... That was an interesting sound effect. <laughs> then I'll get into that um, supply cache. 
Come on. Heal up. I'm trying to heal you, bull. Don't walk away from me. Don't you walk away from me. Almost got him. I mean, I'm hoping that these will be replenished, but I'm kind of thinking that maybe they won't be replenished. We'll see what happens. That's why I went ahead and did that right then. Because, I mean, these did get replenished for me. So, all of my health potions came back, but my regen potions didn't. And neither did Varix. So, I guess that supply cache, all it does is it gives us more health potions. It doesn't help in the, um... Regen potion category. Let's read this. Torn Notebook in the Deep Roads, Section 2. Many of these pages are filled with sketches of elven statues matching the ones found in the area, along with notes in what look like attempts to pr practice Kunlat. They say the agent of Fenharel caused trouble in the crossroads. I wish I knew. I wish whoever fights in the name of the Old Wolf was around to fight when the Darkspawn took my clan. Mine is not to question. I have chosen the Kun. The Kun will protect me. Uh, let's see. Rethost, you all protect. Ret Hadim, they all protect. Ret Hassam, we all protect. These statues are older than anything I saw in my days with the clan. The area is dwarven, though. What were the ancient elves doing down here? Mining? Where were the dwarves? Easier to have them mine it. Not a trading post. You don't go into a friend's home, knock over their gods, and put up your own. War? I don't remember any legends about our people fighting the dwarves. Though I remember my keeper telling a story about how the dwarves fear the sun because of Elganon's fire. A metaphor for the elves of Arlathan driving the dwarves underground? The Kunari like metaphors. I should share that. Okay. Alright. Well, it's time for me to end this episode, so I'm going to do so now. When we come back, uh, I'll probably run up there if I remember, just to see what's going on up there. And then uh, we'll run down here and uh, face this guy, uh, Sarabas. He's the guy that we've come here for, I guess. I don't know. We still haven't found any Gatlock primers, though. So make sure you come back next time to find out how this battle goes. And uh, hopefully at some point I'll get an opportunity to choose a different party, because... I don't think I like this party. <laughs> I'm blaming it on my party. That's what I'm doing. It's not because I suck. It's because I, I, I picked the wrong party. Well, thank you guys so much for joining me on this play session. I hope you enjoyed it. If you didn't want you to let me know by leaving me a like or a comment, I sure would appreciate that. If you're not a subscriber, won't you please consider subscribing? Thank you guys so much for watching. I sure do hope you join me again in the next episode.